TV at vafatv.com. The Division 3 preliminary final preview. I'm joined by the Division 3 scribe, Chris Neal. Chris, great to have you back. Um, fascinating results. It's the section with the final six, and we saw one of those upsets come through last week. Uh, Richmond Central getting over the line. Yeah, well, if one team was going to upset, I think it was going to be Richmond Central. They had a good run of form coming in. I think that's uh, six in the row now for Richmond, so... It's going to be a good game, Richmond, between Aquinas again this week. Of course, a quirk of the system, Emmaus and Leos became the highest loser, so Swinburne Uni would have lost their game on the Saturday, thinking there's still a chance, and then on Sunday they find out they're out. Yeah, that's right. I mean, Emmaus was stiff as well. I think they lost their top position on the ladder in the last round, so they could have been playing up at Park, but I guess if anyone's going to complain about the system, it can't be Northern Blues, because they were the ones to come from six last year and win the grand final. So well, that's of course, the Northern Blues, Blues they're, they're arguably the ones that do have a reason to complain. They now meet the second side, uh, Amazing Leonard says the bottom place loser versus the, the highest place winner. Um, how are Blues feeling about that? You can, you can give us the inside word. Uh, well, like I said, they can't really complain too much about it. Um, as for the matchup, Blues and Amaze went one and one during the year, so I think it'll be a pretty even contest. Uh, both teams won away from home, so... I don't think there'll be too much of an advantage between either side. Uh, Northern Blues uh, looking for double promotion. Uh, Amazing Leeds who have come back, um, you know, leading into a game like this. Who's got uh, more to play for? Who wants to, you know, how, how much is the carrot out there to try and get promotion and uh, make a grand final? I mean, the, the grand final is obviously a huge aspect, but for a new side like the Northern Blues, uh, promotion's massive. It means a lot for sort of promoting players to the club. And I guess for Amaius, they want to shoot straight back up. So both sides have a lot to play for. Who are you to lean to in that uh, preliminary final? Well, I have to go for the Blues. They uh, won their round 13 matchup by about 25 points, so they've got the form going in, and I think Amaze have uh, won three of their last six, losing to Richmond, Aquinas, and uh, the Northern Blues in that span. So yeah, It's a worrying uh, trend for Amaze and Leo as their form over the past uh, month or so. Um, one, oh, the other preliminary final is with two teams, but we don't know how they match up against each other because they haven't played for three months. Uh, round seven was the last time they played. Aquinas getting over the, uh, the Snakes by seven points in that run where the Snakes were not going too well. Yeah, uh, Aquinas, I think that was a Kevin Bartlett reserve. The Aquinas got up by seven points. So, yeah, you can't really read too much into that head-to-head because that was back in round seven. I think Richmond lost five of six games in that span. So it'll be a completely different side of Qantas coming against this round. And I think, again, that's another game that could go either way. Uh, who do you think's going to win this one? It's, it's, a, it's a great final series, the Division Three final series, but who do you think will win this one, Aquinas and uh, Richmond Central? Uh, I'm going to go Richmond, and then that'll probably make for a great final between uh, the Northern Blues and Richmond, because Richmond uh, beat the Blues twice throughout the year. That would be fascinating to see, and the mentality of going into a game like So you're going for the Snakes to come from fifth and make a grand final. Yeah, that's right. Good on you, Chris. Uh, still sticking with Blues for the flag? Still sticking with Blues for the flag, yep. We'll see you again next week. That's the Division 3 wrap. Baffer TV at vafatv.com.